Hi, I'm Vahid Razavi with BizCloud. I'm here with Jonathan Paskey, founder of Developer Week and Data Week. And Jonathan, thank you so much for your time this afternoon. No Greatly problem. appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, I'm here at Data 2.0 Summit, another great event that you guys have organized right. all around data. But I'm interested in learning more about Data Week that's coming up. Sure. Um, sure. Could you tell us a little about the conference and the kinds of people that are going to be attending uh, and the exhibitors and speakers that are going to be there? Sure, sure. Uh, so at, at Data 2.0, our, our, our mantra is making data more accessible. And, um, one of, the, one of the themes that we have for Data Week this year is uh, democratizing data, and that's our 2013 theme for all of our data events. Um, what we're gonna, really going to be focusing on at Data Week, uh, Data Week is the largest uh, San Francisco-based data conference and API conference. Um, we're actually co-locating with another conference this year that we're, pro we're producing because we're finding a, a very big um, push in the API space. Uh, this year, in, especially with um, API marketplaces. And so we've spun up another conference called API World. API World uh, will be co-located with Data Week Conference and Expo this year, and we're expanding the conference. Uh, last year we had about 1,500 attendees throughout a week long of series of events, including a hackathon over the weekend uh, and four days of conference. Uh, this year we'll have the same, uh, a hackathon on the weekend at Data Week, and uh, we'll have uh, two days of workshops and two days of, uh, of conference and expo. And we've moved the event to the Fort Mason Center here in San Francisco, uh, where we have a lot more space, and a lot more ability to sort of break out the session. So uh, for example, uh, we have a lot of summits that we're gonna be spinning up this year uh, around uh, uh, topics such as Hadoop, R, Python, uh, really hands-on workshops mm -hmm. uh, that'll really dig into um, what the developers and the engineers really want, which is sort of a, a hands-on, here's how to do, uh, you know, how to workshop uh, uh, around different topics. Um, we also will uh, uh, partner that with a lot of thought leadership panels and a lot of thought leadership uh, spotlights and lightning talks. Uh, that's new for us this year, uh, the lightning talk format that's uh, become so popular. Um, where we have uh, 10 to 15 minute talks uh, from speakers all across the data ecosystem, uh, from uh, vendors all the way to users and developers, um, uh, from different spaces in data visualization all the way to the you know, big data space as well. Great, well I mean, any developer knows you can't build an application in right. a silo anymore. You <laughs> have to build on top of other APIs. That's true. You would need to build on top of platforms like Hadoop clusters and what right. have you. So and so we have everything from the bottom of the data stack all the way to the top. and that's really the holistic approach we take at Data Week. Wow, wonderful. How many uh, attendees do you expect at the conference? What, right. What's going to be the turnout like? Yeah, we expect about 2,500 to 3,000 attendees this year between the two conferences, uh, Data Week and API World. Um, and uh, the, the attendees we're expecting to be all the way from, like I mentioned before, the entrepreneurs uh, that are starting new data startups uh, to the engineers and the developers that are working on, you know, like I mentioned, the usually the bottom of the data stack uh, in Hadoop or NoSQL, MongoDB. They're really, really looking to uh, understand the new trends there. Um, all the way up to the business users on the top of the data stack, which are trying to understand really when I, how can I use big data? How is big data relevant to my community? And one of the cool things that we do here with uh, our Data 2.0 conferences is that we try to mash everything up, right? We try, we try to bring those business users together with those engineers because that's where we really feel the magic happens. Uh, you know, most of the, the, the other conferences will focus on one particular vertical or one particular area. We try to bring it all together and uh, you know, put those, the, those ind different individuals on panels together. We had a session here at the Data 2.0 Summit today where we did a crowdsourced uh, uh, voting around uh, the different panels that, we wanted to, that the, the audience wanted to see data week this year uh, which was you know something unique for for what we did as well so, wonderful so yeah. what came out in terms of that conclusion of that panel uh, we found like I was mentioning before we found that uh, a lot there was actually a really big dichotomy there was a lot of business users that mm -hmm. wanted to really see what the business use cases were for data in their different industries and then on the other side a lot of developers and engineers that really wanted to dig down into getting hands-on and real-world uh, training as far as how do I use these different systems because what we're finding we started uh, data to 2.0 three years ago in 2000. Uh, our first conference was 2011. This is our third annual Data 2.0. Congratulations! Summit. And uh, thank you. And uh, you know, 
the data economy has expanded so much since then. Uh, where back then we were really focused on the um, the open data movement and uh, open gov. Uh, we were also focused on a little bit on the uh, the big data movement, but that was just just uh, get picking up steam. But now we're finding that uh, you know data data visualization is becoming really huge. Like I mentioned before, APIs are becoming so huge, so huge that you know we are uh, at, at this point uh, partnering with a couple of companies to spin up the API World Conference because we feel that it's it, it deserves its own programming by itself. You know, one thing I'm really impressed by, Jonathan, is that whole range of attendees and exhibitors that you were talking about. Mm -hmm. I see a lot of companies that are also startups, mm -hmm. as well as established David and Goliaths that are right. going to be at this conference. And I think that mix is generally really healthy for tech events, yeah. and it's sometimes missing, because sometimes it's, the cost is too high to play for a lot of exhibitors right. and to be there, or, or bringing outside speakers that are not even exhibiting at the facility, <laughs> right. Right? right? And just opening it up to thought leaders as right. opposed to being yeah. a ticket for an event for a show and that's what I really liked about the way data week uh, and developer week are organized I'm, right. I got to give that to you and it's, Jeff it's a very grassroots uh, sort of an organization that we we try to run and, and like you mentioned our price points um, are typically about uh, you know 50 to 60 percent of what you would see at other conferences of our scale and our scope um, and, and caliber as well and, and we do that on purpose we do that so they are accessible to the data startups um, and so that, that what that does is it attracts you know, about a 20 to 30 percent enterprise audience, about a 20 to 30 percent uh, startup audience, and then everybody else is kind of in the middle in the, in the SMB market. Um, and what that does for us is it really brings together you know, the enterprise with the startups. And we, what we find is a lot of the enterprise um, exhibitors and sponsors of our events really come away with uh, being able to see new products and new technologies that they wouldn't have had an, an opportunity to see at a, at a very enterprise focused conference. Yeah, well, on BizCloud side, what we're excited yeah. about at Data Week is the fact that we're going to be able to take that material and share it with a much larger audience Correct. online. And, and I mean, we would love everybody to attend Data Week, don't get us wrong, but right. we do have an online audience of technology enthusiasts, big data scientists, people that are trying to solve really uh, challenging business problems and they may not be able to attend the conference. Right. So what we're doing is we're going to be producing content around the speakers, around the talks, around the uh, highlights of each of the sessions on behalf of Data Week, and, and also we're going to be streaming the entire event on BizCloud Network, making that available for right. our audience on online solutions. And that's something solutions. new for us, right? So we've, we've done a little bit of live streaming in the past, but never through a network like, uh, like BizCloud, so we're really excited to be partnering with you guys. Absolutely. So I wish you guys much success. Please keep us updated in regards to your progress, yes. and uh, we're looking yeah. forward to seeing you on so, uh, uh, September Data, 28th. Yeah, Data Week is uh, September 28th through October 3rd, 2013. Great. And where do we sign up if you want to attend? Uh, you go to dataweek.co. Uh, online or apiworld.co as well. So, Wonderful. Thanks, thanks again, Jonathan. Yeah, Greatly you. appreciate your time. Yeah.